The Institution of Mechanical Engineers IMESH is an independent professional association and learn society headquartered in London, United Kingdom, that represents mechanical engineers and the engineering profession. With over 120,000 members in 140 countries, working across industries such as railways, automotive, aerospace, manufacturing, energy, biomedical and construction, the institution is licensed by the Engineering Council to assess candidates for inclusion on its Register of Chartered Engineers, Incorporated Engineers and Engineering Technicians. The institution was founded at the Queen's Hotel, Birmingham, by George Stevenson in 1847. It received a royal charter in 1930. The institution's headquarters, purpose built for the institution in 1899, is situated at No. 1 Birdcage Walk in central London. Origins. Informal meetings are said to have taken place in 1846, at locomotive designer Charles Bayer's house in Cecil Street, Manchester, or alternatively at Bromsgrove at the house of James McConnell, after viewing locomotive trials at the Licky Incline. Bayer, Richard Peacock, George Selby, Archibald Slate and Edward Humphreys were present. Bromsgrove seems the more likely candidate for the initial discussion, not least because McConnell was the driving force in the early years. A meeting took place at the Queen's Hotel in Birmingham to consider the idea further on 7 October and a committee appointed with McDonnell at its head to see the idea to its inauguration. The Institution of Mechanical Engineers was then founded on 27 January 1847, in the Queen's Hotel next to Curzon Street Station in Birmingham by the railway pioneer George Stevenson and others. McConnell became the first chairman. The founding of the institution was said by Stevenson's biographer Samuel Smiles to have been spurred by outrage that Stevenson, the most famous mechanical engineer of the age, had been refused admission to the Institution of Civil Engineers unless he sent in a probationary essay as proof of his capacity as an engineer. However, this account has been challenged as part of a pattern of exaggeration on Smiles' part aimed at glorifying the struggles that various Victorian mechanical engineers had to overcome in their personal efforts to attain greatness. Though there was certainly coolness between Stevenson and the Institution of Civil Engineers, it is more likely that the motivation behind the founding of the Institution of Mechanical Engineers was simply the need for a specific home for the growing number of mechanical engineers employed in the burgeoning railway and manufacturing industries. Bayer proposed that George Stevenson become the institution's first president in 1847, followed by his son, Robert Stevenson in 1849. Bayer became vice president and was one of the first to present papers to the institution. Charles Geach was the first treasurer. Throughout the 19th and 20th centuries some of Britain's most notable engineers held the position of president, including Joseph Whitworth, Carl Wilhelm Siemens and Sir Harry Ricardo. It operated from premises in Birmingham until 1877 when it moved to London, taking up its present headquarters on Birdcage Walk in 1899. <inaudible> <inaudible> Birdcage Walk Upon its move to London in 1877 the institution rented premises at No. 10 Victoria Chambers, where it remained for 20 years. In 1895 the institution bought a plot of land at Storys Gate, on the eastern end of Birdcage Walk, for £9,500. Architect Basil Slade looked to the newly completed Admiralty buildings facing the site for inspiration. The building was designed in the Queen Anne, streaky bacon, style in red brick and Portland stone. 
Inside, there were several features that were state-of-the-art for the time, including a telephone, a 54-inch fan in the lecture theater for driving air into the building, an electric lift from the Otis Elevator Company, and a synchronome master clock, which controlled all house timepieces. In 1933 architect James Miller, who also designed the neighboring Institution of Civil Engineers, remodeled the building, expanding the library and introducing electric lighting. The building would go on to host the first public presentation of Frank Whittle's jet engine in 1945. In 1943 it became the venue for the Royal Electrical and Mechanical Engineers planning of Operation Overlord and the invasion of Normandy. Today No. 1 Birdcage Walk hosts events, lectures, seminars and meetings in 17 conference and meeting rooms named after notable former members of the institution, such as Whittle, Stevenson and Charles Parsons. Topic. Membership grades and post-nominals The following are membership grades with post-nominals Affiliate, no post-nominal the grade for students, apprentices and those interested in or involved in mechanical engineering who do not meet the requirements for the following grades. Amimesh, Associate Member of the Institution of Mechanical Engineers, this is the grade for graduates of acceptable degrees or equivalents in engineering, mathematics or science. Mimechi, Member of the Institution of Mechanical Engineers. For those who meet the educational and professional requirements for registration as a Chartered Mechanical Engineer and also as a Chartered Engineer or Incorporated Engineer or Engineering Technician in Mechanical Engineering. FIMESH, Fellow of the Institution of Mechanical Engineers, this is the highest class of elected membership, and is awarded to individuals who have demonstrated exceptional commitment to an innovation in mechanical engineering. <laughs> Awards The James Watt International Medal is an award for excellence in engineering established in 1937 by the Institution of Mechanical Engineers. It is named after Scottish engineer James Watt who developed the Watt steam engine in 1781, which was fundamental to the changes brought by the Industrial Revolution in both his native Great Britain and the rest of the world. The Engineering Heritage Awards were created in 1984 to help recognize and promote the value of artifacts, locations, collections and landmarks of significant engineering importance. Along with the manufacturer, the institution also runs the Manufacturer MX Awards, and Formula Student, the world's largest student motorsport event. Topic. Presidents As of 2018, there have been 134 presidents of the institution, who since 1922 have been elected annually for one year. The first president was George Stevenson, followed by his son Robert. Prior to 2018, Joseph Whitworth, John Penn and William Armstrong were the only presidents to have served two terms. Pamela Liversidge in 1997 became the first female president, Professor Isabel Pollock became the second in 2012 and Carolyn Griffiths became the third in 2017. <laughs> List of presidents Baker resigned in June 2018. The institutions by laws state that a casual vacancy for president shall be filled by appointing a past president to the role. Tony Roche was elected and duly took up office for a second term in August of that year. Topic engineering committees The Institution of Mechanical Engineers has a number of committees that work to promote and develop thought leadership in different industry sectors. 
The institution has eight divisions, Aerospace, Automobile, Biomedical Engineering Association, Construction and Building Services, Manufacturing Industries, Power Industries, Process Industries and Railway, Biomedical Engineering Association BMEA, aims to bring together key workers from both medicine and engineering to discuss the latest advances and issues, to enable networking among different industry leaders, and to promote the field of medicine medical engineering, also known as bioengineering or biomedical engineering, to government, healthcare professionals and the wider public. This committee offers, seminars, lectures and conferences every year, the Journal of Engineering in Medicine, the annual student project competition. The Railway Division was formed in 1969 when the Institution of Locomotive Engineers amalgamated with IMESH. See also Engineering James Watt International Medal Chartered Engineer Proceedings of the Institution of Mechanical Engineers Footnotes <laughs>